What's up? I'm Wanted Turtle, and we are starting our brand new series, The Hunt for the Reverse Tortuga. You heard that right. So we've been on the Rainbow Zard hunt. We've been on the Rainbow Reshi Ram hunt. Actually, we completed both of those, but we're starting our next hunt. It's a little bit different. You might not have get, or <laughs> maybe you did guess it, but we are looking for that reverse Tortuga. <laughs> yeah, you know, Rainbow Mewtwo Mew. Sure, that's a that's a that's a very solid pickup. But you know what? We got to keep your eye on the prize. Focus up. We're going for that reverse Tortuga. So far. And opening one box of booster packs, we've gotten two Tortugas. So not only do we need the reverse, but we need to up our Tortuga count in general. We're going to see just how many we can pull. So far, we only have two. And we're going to open up some booster packs. Uh, let's see, how many do we have? Eight. So we have eight booster packs to boost our Tortuga count. Because let's be honest, guys, that's what it's all about. You know, hey, if we pull some ultra rares along the way, we'll take it. But, uh,. Yeah, that reverse. That's what we're going for. Not sure how long it'll take us. And to be honest, like when you, if you try to pull like a very specific reverse, <laughs> I really do think I'll, that. I mean, it's obviously it's one of those things where it could end really quick or it could take a long time. Um, all right, let's get into this. Tornadus for our first pack. Swadloon. Why not? Cottony. Formantis. Swaddle. Marini, a Litwick, find friend, search your deck for flame Pokemon, and reveal it and put it in your hand. Hmm. I wonder, is that good? So like in a Reshizard deck, in a way this can just search up and sure it's like a free prize for your opponent, but when you have tag teams, you still need, and you can, as long as you get it so they still need to knock out two tag teams, you're fine. Poipo, I feel like this is the second, maybe third reverse Poipo you have, we've pulled, but uh, oh wow, right off the bat, we got a GX pull. Espeon and Deoxys. I don't think this card is that good, but let's take a look. Uh, 260 HP, 30 damage for each of your bench psychic Pokemon. Ah, uh, okay. I feel like this could, um, you know, if you go heavy on the Mewtwo Mew, you throw some Espeon Deoxys, you throw some Latios, you can, this card can actually be okay. I guess max, that's only 190 for 3 energy. Um... I, I'm not sure that's quite good enough, but uh, it's an interesting card. So, Unified Minds. What an interesting set. We're one box in, and the pull rates are insane. Um, and I want to run a theory by you guys. So, as you know, I am on the Hidden Fates hype train through and through. I think Unified Minds will be a very quick... You know, not the best set, and I, I feel like this thing is hyped in the beginning, um, but I do think it'll fall off pretty quickly, especially with Hidden Fates coming out. That thing will just, you know, people will forget about this set, in my opinion, very quickly. Ooh, Guard Chomp Reverse, very nice. Avenging Aura, very cool ability. If you're behind on prizes, you do 80 more damage for attacks. And then Drift Blim. But, um... Yeah, so that's just my general theory, and what are the chances? Let me know what you think about this in the comment below. That... I wonder if Pokemon Company understands that. And it's like, you know what, there's... Actually, there's a lot of good cards in it, but there's not that super big chase card. While Mewtwo Mew is a big deal, I don't think it'll even come close to the hype of Rainbow Zard, Reshi Zard, uh, and then Shiny Zard, <laughs> which is coming out at the end of the month. So, and hear me out. And I feel like this is, this would be, if it's true, like it's genius by them and it's good for us, obviously. It's like, all right, well, let's just up the pull rates so, you know, that we can raise the hype. Um, you know, it'll help, maybe it'll help, wow, another reverse rare. We got Scrafty. It'll help everyone and everyone will be happy. So that's just the theory I'm working with. Like, I, I know like a lot of people are unhappy with Unbroken Bonds. But you know, but they had the the Reshizard to back it up, so the the demand was still there. Everyone still wanted those cards. So, but this this set, you know, it's I feel like it's going to be really good for the meta game. But for collectability, honestly, I honestly don't feel like there's that too much. Like, you know, Tortuga. That's what we're going for. Not this ugly big turtle guy. You know, yeah. Uh, 
I, I'd totally go the Ash Ketchum route and like totally not evolve my Tortuga <laughs> if I had one. Alright, we're going with the Barrel. Bound Sweet. Joltik, or maybe it's, uh, I think Bulbasaur also refused to evolve, right? Maybe that's the better analogy versus like Ash Ketchum refusing to evolve. Man, I'm not sure. Alright, we got Honage for the reverse still. No Tortuga and a Silvalli Hollow. Alright, let's see what we got. Avenging Heart. 50 more damage for each prize card your opponent took on their last turn. Hmm. No, no, no. Air Slash. 120. Discard energy. Double no. But, uh, yeah. Let me know your thoughts. You know, what are the chances? Uh, I'm... Obviously, I'm super stoked about the increased pull rates, and that seems to be, you know, it's not our first box, which we got an insane number of hits. It's not an isolated case by any means. Um, so I feel like all good news all around, and that's just my running theory right now, that before we get too excited and expect this going forward, what if this is like a unified mind-specific special, and things will cool off? Cause, because, you know what? Hidden Fates, just, just going to push unified minds to size like hey guys focus up we got some shinies for you and everyone's gonna go nuts all right we got riolu man still no tortugas i mean i suppose it's possible that i wasn't paying attention but i highly doubt that yeah all right eight pack tortugas uh it is uncommon and this set is huge like what is that 236 cards uh, not including secrets and you get like what three uncommons per uh, per pack. So yeah, Tortuga, guys, I'm telling you, Tortuga is where it's at. Everyone should be on that hunt for that reverse <laughs> Tortuga. We got an Elgem U-turn board, Bidoof, Skurupi, Wimpod, Noibat, Sneasel, a Driftblim reverse, and then a Zerga Tree. So how are your Unified Minds pulls going? Um, I feel like a lot of people are doing really well, uh, especially with these increased pull rates. But uh, what is it that you're still searching for? And most importantly, what is your Tortuga count? Uh, and have you been fortunate enough to pull that reverse? Let me know in a comment down below. We got a Mesprit, Sableye, Lapras. I do like these cards that kind of have like very specific synergies. Um, Always a big fan of those. Square Rupee, Wimpod, as long as they're not overpowered, as long as they're very like niche and like you can make it work, but you have to kind of get lucky. Those are the ones I appreciate the most. Another reverse rare. I want the reverse uncommons. And then we have, oh, a guard. Man, I, I could make a guard chomp deck right now. Um, I could make a Zergatry deck, although I don't think I want to. Let's just take a quick look. Signal Beam, Confused. Yeah, no. No, thank you. On to our last pack already. Still no Tortugas. Can we get some last pack magic? And I'm not talking about a Ultra. I'm talking about that sweet uncommon. Here we go. We got a Fighting Energy. Stadium Nav. I think that could be a good card. Gabite. Cherish Ball. Such a good card. Tynamo. Oh, we did not get it. Guys, Tortuga is very hard to pull. We got a Sawaddle. Our reverse is a Unpheasant. And Toxapex. This card's terrible. <laughs> so that is it. We are still only on Tortuga count of two. Alright, we gotta step up our game, guys. Uh, I guess we can celebrate the fact that we got an Espeon and Deoxys, but we did miss the mark on our primary objective, our primary and secondary objective, but uh, we'll settle for that ultra rare tag team. And uh, that's it for today's open, a little bit quicker than yesterday's. As always, guys, like, comment, and subscribe down below. I'm Wanda Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.